My son, keep sound wisdom and discretion. Let them not escape from your sight, and they will be the life for your soul and adornment for your neck. Then you will walk on your way securely, and your foot will not stumble. If you sit down, you will not be afraid. When you lie down, your sleep will be sweet. Do not be afraid of sudden panic or of the ruin of the wicked when it comes, for the Lord will be your confidence and will keep your foot from being caught. Do not withhold good from those whom it is due when it is in your power to do it. Do not say to your neighbor, go and come again. Tomorrow I will give it when you have it with you. Do not plan evil against your neighbor who dwells trustingly beside you. Do not contend with a man for no reason when he has done you no harm. Do not envy a man of violence and do not choose any of his ways. For the perverse man is an abomination to the Lord, but the upright are in his confidence. The Lord's curse is on the house of the wicked, but he blesses the abode of the righteous. Toward the scorners he is scornful, but to the humble he shows favor. The wise will inherit honor, but fools get disgrace. Yes, literally every doctor says this, but uh, I'm telling you every single tooth of my child has had a fever. And you know my philosophy, I trust parents more than I trust doctors. You can't read how to raise children in books. So my philosophy, but I should say I'm not. A my child has literally gone up to 104 for every single tooth that he has cracked. So um, that might be your experience, but the common denominator in the comments is that everyone is saying it's super normal to go up to a high fever same he will not put down his pacifier and we are not a pacifier family we only allow him to have a pacifier to go to sleep and he will not let it out of his mouth so having the same experience A few of you guys that were asking me to share responses, right now I have about 6,000 responses and I would say 98% of them are saying absolutely. It's molars and it can last up to seven days is the common, I'm just giving you like the common answer. And then I would say like 2% saying, well, it shouldn't be seven days it like, or it shouldn't be four days. Mine, it was just as aggressive, but it wasn't as long. So that hopefully gives you guys an idea. You guys know me, I trust moms more than I trust doctors to tell me their experiences and I'm so grateful that you guys responded because I feel so much better now. Thank you.